Friday about 9.45 a.m. Started off this morning, uh, I thought it was a good night's sleep, got about eight hours sleep last night. Woke up around a little bit after four, took a warm bath with coffee. Enjoying the warm bath, kind of loosens up my, the stiff muscles. That felt great. Trained a couple people this morning. Had a, had a Zoom call, working with some, soft, uh, some, some nutrition and training software collaboration to help people uh, have better access to some of this information. And just gearing up for uh, uh, meal number two here. Got uh, basmatic rice with lentil and miso paste, with, uh, some seaweed, seaweed there, and a power shake with hemp protein and almond milk. All right. So I'm going to drink about a gallon of water today, and all right, let's see you next. Fitness and finance, kicking off meal number two. I want some basmatic rice with lentil, some seaweed, and some hemp protein with almond milk. Already trained a couple people this morning. Had a collaboration Zoom video working with a with a great couple people on some software with uh, really delivering some nutrition and training information. So this morning earlier started off with a with a hot bath trying to get the body body loose, and then tonight about 6 p.m. Uh, hitting up the back biceps hamstrings and calves. So, see you then. Trained a few more people, back for the next meal. Got uh, some jasmine rice with chickpeas, onions, garlic, and a green smoothie. Trying to keep it healthy, clean. Um, right now I'm about um, 175. My goal is to be about 185. So I'm looking to add 10 more pounds of quality, quality, hopefully just almost all muscle. So I'm going to work on that while also too building up my, my left leg that I've been dealing with and I'll talk more about that later, but I'm dealing with an, an injury to my left side. But uh, part of this journey is, uh, part of this vlog is just sharing within my journey. I did some uh, banded distractions earlier, I'll talk more about that later. And I got a couple more people to train, and then we'll hit the weights later. So I can't wait to hit the weights. I love getting that pump. So I'm just my goal right now is to drink a gallon of water for the workout. Eat up as much as I can. I'm gonna load up on this meal right here. Got some. <clears throat> also have some vegan chocolate chip cookies, probably for some extra carbs. And I'm gonna drink plenty of water. Hopefully get a nice pump a little later on. And all right, that's it. I'll talk to you later. Bye for now. Bitcoin update, September 22nd, 2023, around 3.30 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. We have just broken and closed to confirm this recent idea. If you're interested in creating your own zones on your own terms, reach out to me and let's collaborate. Tight hips. Well, we're gonna, I'm going to show you a couple things to do, how to work out some, how to work out some tight hips. And this is going to be part of, the, part of my vlog for my journey as I'm loosening my, my hips. I've been dealing with a left tight hip. So I'm going to show you a couple things. We're going to go over a couple of little banded distractions. This is one thing I found for my physical therapist that has been really helpful. It's called banded distraction. I'm just going to hook, hook it on anything resistance wise. About, about a hip level at the hip. I'm going to back out and stretch into it. And you just kind of, what's kind of nice is you just kind of, kind of play around with it. Oh yeah, just kind of get it loose. Good, you want to keep, um, if you're dealing with a tight hip, one thing that helps is movement, and circulation, and getting more blood flow, and Another thing that kind of I think about when I think about that is making sure you're drinking plenty of water. 
for most men, I'd say a gallon, gallon of water a day. And for most women, I'd say about 100 ounces, almost three quarters of a gallon, about that, of water. What that's going to do is that's going to really help loosen up everything because you want your... We want our joints to be really hydrated. If they're really hydrated, they're going to be feeling at least the best that you could possibly feel. When I'm doing these, I'm just kind of playing around with it. Different little angles. So, so far today, I've Drink about gotten about my whole gallon, got my ga whole gallon down today already. I did. It's about four o'clock Pacific Standard Time where I'm at, and uh, my goal is usually to have my water intake down. My goal, which is a gallon, almost all by four. That way, I'm not up peeing all night. <laughs> Feels good. This feels good. So I gotta. So this is a. This is kind of my my. Testing my vlog on fitness and finance. So to, so today I've. I've trained a bunch of people. Done some stuff regarding website. For for training and weight loss clients and stuff like that. And I'm also in the cryptocurrency market. So I've. Been tracking Bitcoin. I'll make sure a little bit of those clips in, with these vlogs. We'll see how, how, how it goes. But I, I do keep a close eye on Bitcoin. I'm just really fascinated with Bitcoin and all the other cryptocurrencies that go along with it. So it's just to me, it's like a, I don't know, fascinating. So fascinating. So I did a lot of that already. I did that. I got two more, two more clients. And my last client, uh, really great I can actually work out while we're while, we're, while I'm training him I can actually work out with him which is a lot of fun for for both of us so we're gonna be working on some back and biceps hamstrings and calves so right now I'm about 175 six or seven percent body fat going for about 185 six or seven percent body fat that's my that's my goal so all right so I'm gonna I'm gonna do the other leg here in a minute, but the, I just did the most challenged leg uh, right now. Just to show you what I'm, what we're doing, what I'm doing. There's different thicknesses on these bands. This is about a medium, so use whatever is uh, appropriate for you. We'll see you, see you on the next lesson. All right, so that's about a little bit after 6 p.m. Just wrapped up the day. Had about 10 personal training sessions, worked on some app that we're doing for training and nutrition that our online clients can uh, track and, and learn and do better. So we worked on some software for that today. Uh, so yeah, so this channel, this theme and my blog is really centered around fitness and finance because those are two things that I'm passionate about and I, I feel like a lot of people um, want to do better in those areas, fitness and finance. Uh, so the saying that I go with my channel is, health is wealth, cash flow is king, cash is queen, and credit is freedom. So think about that. Health is wealth, cash flow is king, cash is queen, and credit is freedom. Give you something to think about. So I just wrapped up. Um, my last session uh, was with a, a buddy of mine named Ethan. And so I'm training him, and I get to train at the same time. So I'm standing right behind uh, behind me is one of my favorite devices in our studio here. It's a, I don't know if you can see it up top right here, but we have multiple grips for the pull-up. So we started off our workout today. We did a, a set of 10, but five different grips. So I feel like uh, the back is a very complex muscle group that... Um, Hitting it from different angles, I feel like really bring out the shape and definition. 
because you want each muscle to, to bring out, like you have your, your lats, right? You have your middle back, right? You have your lower back, you have your, your glutes, your traps, your hamstrings. So there's a lot of things to kind of think about. So hitting things from different angles, I feel like gives us an opportunity to really develop the, the, the back to the best possible. So, so as we're tracking, I'm gonna, um, I'm kind of, I'm eating clean, but yet I still want to gain weight. So I'm kind of in that middle space where I, I like being lean. I'm about 175 pounds, six, seven percent body fat. But my goal was to be 185 pounds, and I'd like to stay six or seven percent body fat. I don't really want to increase my body fat. So, but after this, I found that I can eat quite a bit and not gain fat. So after this, I'm going to go home. I'll. I'll I'll figure out, I don't know exactly quite, but it's gonna involve some carbs and some protein. So probably about 100 grams of carbs in white rice or jasmine rice and about 40 grams of carbs in a, in a protein mix. I'll start with that and then go from there. Um, but that's, that's it for now. And so, yeah, so remember that health is wealth, cash flow is king, cash is queen, Credit is freedom. See you in the next lesson. Definitely want to bring out more definition through here. So I'm working on my left side, so my left side and my right side are very different. I'm recovering from an injury, or working through on this side here, so I'm really trying to bring up the mass on the left side. Put more muscle on over here. So Arnold used to talk about when you're building your physique, think of it almost like you're building a, a sculpture. And so if you have something lacking in one area, you just want to put the clay on that area. But the thing is in bodybuilding and in, and in the fitness, we, we have to work the muscle, feed it, sleep it to, to get that full, to, to build it there. You can't just slap on some clay, right? So, okay, so this is the physique check-in. Right now, September 22nd. <sighs> kind of half between a bulk, half between a cut. But I uh, definitely want to increase by 10 pounds and would like to stay really lean in the process. So my goal is to gain, to get to be 185 and 175. Right now, to get to about 185, so healthy and balanced and strong. All right, see you on the next one. Final meal of the night. Gonna have a shake with about 40 grams, with 40 grams, not about 40 grams, I'm being more specific with my amounts. 40 grams of protein, plus two servings of berries, uh, blueberries, I love blueberries. I have with almond milk, made with almond milk. And then I'm also gonna add a, an additional 150 uh, carbs coming from about 100 carbs, 80 carbs coming from uh, jasmine rice, and about another well, 20 is from the blueberries, and then another 50 is going to be from two slices of whole grain bread with peanut butter and jelly.
And I'm doing all this in an effort to gain. So if I was uh, somebody that, if you're trying to cut, if you're trying to lean down, that would be too much. But everybody's different, right? That's the thing everybody's, you know. So I'm, my, my personal journey is I'm trying to build on a plant-based diet at 55 years old, just turned, recently turned 55, and do it in a healthy way, and overcoming this injury that I've been dealing with. I've been dealing with the left hip injury, and I'll probably get more into it, but just part of the just sharing with you everything I'm doing, I'm trying to be as healthy as I can, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye for now.